Hello guys, BrickClick here, and I'm going to show you how LEGO minifigures are made. Stay tuned to find out more. So welcome back to another video, hope you're having a great day. If you do go on to enjoy the video, be sure to smash that like button, as well as subscribe and turn on notifications, but let's get into it. So everybody loves the LEGO minifigure, and that's one of the things that everybody loves about LEGO so much, is the humble minifigure. So today I'm going to take through each step of how a minifigure is made and then put together. So let's get into it. Start the production off of the LEGO minifigure, ABS plastic is brought in from an external source, which LEGO buys it off, and is poured into the machines and the moulding machines ready to start making minifigures. So then the torsos are moulded together in a separate machine and brought into this giant conveyor belt, so all the torsos are put into the middle and then they slowly move up a conveyor belt where they're put into a single far track and then they're inserted onto metal sticks that are then transported along the factory line. So you can see this is a very quick production so it's happening at a really quick speed which is really impressive for LEGO to see and then they also put them on the other side of the poles just to increase efficiency and then as you can see these are just put on a huge scale just time and time after again and then a printing press applies some uh, black printing around the neck piece so the head can be easily put on and off so there's not a lot of friction so that's just to make the minifigure smoother and then obviously the printing is put on so the first layer of print will go on and it depends how many layers it has so that's mainly what they do with the um, body piece and then the same happens with the legs so obviously they're on a massive conveyor belt uh, going up and then they just want one leg per uh, single file basically and then they put the legs in these in these molding machines as usual really quick and then the print the legs so this is a really quick process I can see there is a lot going on. They're printed and then they're sent along a conveyor belt when the second print is put on. So they look like Ninjago legs on this production line. Then they're just sent off down a production line, obviously, because these are complete now. Put in a box ready to be put in a separate machine to actually uh, load the sets up. Then the exact same thing is happening with the minifigure heads now. So they're going up a conveyor belt, going into a single file thing. Obviously, it's done with loads of different colored heads. Then they put on two sides of these metal poles again ready to go off to printing at a really quick scale because obviously the factory is moving really quickly so really exciting to see this happening actually what goes into making a lego minifigure so then they put onto this conveyor belt obviously they're moving along and then they push down to make sure they don't fall off when they're spinning around getting all the printing so obviously um, another machine is doing that and now they're going to go on to some printing in just a second but there we go so the printing is now being applied so they'll probably each machine does a little bit extra on the minifigure and then obviously they've rotated all the time just for efficiency really so this is a really efficient production skill to get all the printing done as you can see spinning really quick this is a really fast production line and obviously if anything goes wrong it can have a big effect on so the different printers will add different colors and build up that layering on the minifigure with the different prints which is a really exciting seat to think there's a really a lot goes into it so then these minifigures are now done now so they're obviously being taken away, ready to put in some more sets in the future so and now we got the body print so you can see these have already all been printed but as you probably showed they're missing the arms and then all also the hands so now we'll see they're the arms separate so obviously the um, the body pieces the torso they got the conveyor belt into a single file like all the pieces and then same with the arms so this is a really quick thing as you can see all the torsos put in the bottom then then they slowly wear the way up to the top going into a single file fashion so with the arms and then the torsos are all put onto a conveyor belt and then they're rotated 90 degrees where the arms are also slotted on so as you can see really quick how this is going on the arms are being sorted on so there is a lot going on in the factory i'm sure there's a lot of machines doing this just at once because obviously this is only one torso then i see another machine is passing it to another and then putting their hands onto the minifigure so obviously one machine does one hand and then the other machine does the other hand so it's really quick alternating machines to do each hand which is really cool and then obviously the torso is done then with their arms the hands the legs and then they'll go off to a separate box as we saw with the uh, feet where then they'll obviously be put into another conveyor belt where they'll actually be packaged with the sets which you will open at home so as you see there's loads of absolutely minifigure torsos and heads being produced at one time so this is from the lego factory in 2016 i think this footage so as you see star wars city there's just loads of different themes from where these minifigures being produced obviously loads of face designs and lots of colors as well same with the legs so there's just so much going on in the lego factory and obviously as they produce more sets every year they have to make more machines and at this time when we're, like a lot of people are buying lego during the coronavirus obviously the conveyor belt is a lot big because they're producing a lot more sets to keep up with demand same at christmas so while <laughs> there's a lot going on in that thing obviously so a lot goes into minifigure more than you probably think when you actually take it out of the packet and next time you build a minifigure just think 
how much went into it. But comment down below, did you know anything about LEGO production? You can subscribe, turn on notifications, you can like the video, you can watch any other videos on screen now. Remember to keep clicking and bricking. I'll see you all later guys, bye bye.